hi everyone welcome back to another animation tutorial video of code primes so in this video you are going to learn this like this type of animation as you can see on there the background circle is moving and on this front pages there have a minor so it was still and the background circle is animation and it was moving it is totally 360 degree moving so we are going to make like this type of animation in this video so please watching this full video and if you're interested to get more tutorials like this so you can subscribe our channel right now here we can see here this i've added a basic html code on my code studio and there you can see i've added a title the circle image animation so here first of all inside of this body we need to write some css for the body section so here i just need to open the style file after this body section and paste this body here so now i'm writing that display is flex and here i'm going to writing that is justify content center and a line item also center and another one that is text align it's also center and the main height so it will be 100 VAs so it will be vertically center so this is we have write it the basic for the centering div now we're going to add a background color so here I'm just going to background that is I'm going to selection from this blue and this from blue I will select some drag and drop color so I'm just drop on it now here we have this chart for this item okay here it's taking so a lot now i just need to select the color from here we're already in the blue section now i'm just selecting this color and just selecting from this rgb color it will be created hashtag code so now we have set this now save this file and open with the live server and there you can see a plain background color so now just back to our code studio now here after this body section i need to add a container class so let me add a container class now write some css for the container now here i'm just going to write it some css now here i'm just going to make it the width is 500 pixel and another one is height also the same and now writing here this another thing that is we are going to make it the position so it is position relative so we have said this now this is actually you can check out this live view also there is no changes but there we have a layer that is which is in the center we have the layer that is which is 5 pixel 500 pixel square rectangle so we have this now it is not visible but we can visible it if we want to make some color implement it so here i'm just going to make it background red and save this and we can see here this is the plane this is the circle of the sky in the center we have but we don't need that color background so i'm just making it comment and just we need to back to here the container classes so now i need to add this img dot and here i'm just going to add a circle and open up it now here I add a source file for this img so i'm just slash so background this is where we're going to using the first one this is background this is mg circle so i need to remove this from here and i just need to copy this line again but before going to copy this line so let's write some css for the circle and what was the looking for it now just back to this live server and it was looking like this so you need to set this in the center item and we need to set some sizes for this so now just back to here and first of all we need to take that container that is parent and then we just need to take that img dot and this class name that we have the circle now write some css for this so we just need to line this one line of css that is with this 100 person and it will be completely resize that images in our center so this is completely resizes now we just need to make this another one that is a front mine option so now we just need to copy and paste this line okay that's it back to that code editor and just paste this line now i just need to change this images so here this images name is that xmg and we need to set that this cleanse class name that we need to i'm just setting it the mine now save this file and back to this live server now here we can see this images so we need that images need to be shown on this here in this font of this background images now just need to code editor and we just need to copy this line just copy this line one again and change the class name that is mine so this is the class name and we just need to set here another thing that is position and it is absolute 
extra pollution is absolute and you can see that images will be here so we just need to set them take to here now we have this in the parent class we have the position relative already so now we can move it here simply so here i'm just going to make it now here we need to resize it here the left from the left i'm just going to okay what happened where it's taking this like okay we have this mistake on there now it will be take it from here this left size is i'm just going to take it that is 5 pixel and from the top it is 10 pixel and with i'm just going to make some little bit of a smaller from the 100 person it is 95 person and save this file and open it live server and you can see it was images one here so we can make some little bit of a smaller more and we can move from the left side so here i'm just making this from the left side it is 15 pixel and save this file and it does move it from here so now it was the image is looking perfect from these sizes and from this all over the sizes and it was the, from this all over side it was looking perfect now we need to apply this animation for the background so now we need to go for this or circle images for the css so here we need to write that animation and here i'm just writing the circle for this animation property name now here i'm just going to make it for this one second linear infinite so now copy this the animation property that is circle now here or uh, we can write the css for the circle animation here now open up the keyframe and identifier here we need to write that this animation property now here i'm just writing simple directly that 100 percent and just open it now we have to write that this transform so we want to make this the background circle we want to make the background will be moved from this 360 degree now just here enter here the transform transform and it is rotated and it is 360 degree now save this file and open it the live server and you can see the background is motion was the background moving is started but we need to make some smaller so it was very fast so that's why it was looking like it was going up and move so if we example if we take it here this one second i'm just making it five second 0 0.5 seconds so you can see it was the speed is so much so now we need to decrease that speed so instead of here so i'm just going to writing just six seconds now save this file and back to here now we can see it was a smooth transaction now we can also add another property that is here we are going to add a transition also so that it can be moved this make this all about the movement that is very smoothly so it is i'm going to make it 0 0.5 second and this is done now we can make some little bit of more speed so i'm just making seven second so it will be decreased that speed and it was looking some like some smooth transition here now this background images have some is not a properly circle but there have some issue there so that's why it was making like this but we can make it so if we make it here this with 100 percent and try to make it the height 100 percent so it can be properly oh it's not still but we can set some this directly pixel below 500 and it also 500 now it's looking so little bit of body so let's make it this only 100 percent it will be make that shape that images is the perfectly auto sizes so it was looking like good now if you want to make some slow transition mode so you can increase that the transition time of this animation cycle so now it was looking good so it was looking perfect so you can make this like this type of animation easily and this is this images source file and the code file and this everything i will provide into my video description also you will get this the complete review in our blog so you can follow there also i hope you understand every process and if you enjoyed this tutorial please like on this video and share it with your friends and please subscribe and press the bell icon for more updated and more tutorial like just like this